Good evening, everybody. Again, and uh, today we're gonna—I'm gonna do a review about um, a book, of course, and it's um, a Celtic lore and spellcraft of the Dark Goddess, invoking the Morrigan, by Stephanie Woodfield. So, I got that book. Um, he was barely out of the press. Um, I got it on eBay. And it's a very huge book. He has just a quick second. I just want to see the um, amount of pages that it has because it's really big. It has almost 400 pages, so it's a big book. And quite honestly, if one book like that existed for each and every god and goddesses, ow, that was my cat. <laughs> It'll settle a lot of problems. So, sorry. So basically, um, this is a book about the Morgan, about um, how to call her, her different aspects. Um, there's a little about the uh, mythology, and she's very. The other is very mythotic. So it starts with the mythology, after that the goddesses, after that, um, well, the goddesses that are aspects of the Morgan, after that it goes to, um, uh, you also have a small part on the animals, and um, you have a huge part uh, for different aspects of the Morgan, like uh, shape-shifting. Or, um, just a quick second. Uh, for the Cirrus. The Cirrus, you know. Uh, talks about divination, the Ogun. I think you have some incense also. Uh, divin divin that? divination tool, blessing ritual, uh, Raven, or or that? Raven Oracle Invocation. We're gonna get it one day. And um, you got the Queen of Battle, the Phantom Queen, Mistress of Magic, and after that, at the end, you got the altars and the offerings. So what you can give, how to set an altar, um, germs and germs, gems and crystal that are um, sacred to her. Uh, you also um, have well, if you want to make this goddess your uh, matron goddess, there's a full. Um, Divination, uh, not divination, but the dedication ritual. So I thought it was very good. And also the um, um, seasonal ritual, so all, all of the sabbats and everything, and that's cool. They even put in, well, she, the author even put in um, the Feast of the Morgan. And. Um, you also the new the full moon rites, new moon, um, a glossary, and everything. So that's a very good book. The only one tiny itty bitty 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 thing that I um, got disappointed is that there is one or two sabbats missing. Uh, just a quick second. I think it's. Uh, I don't remember. Ah. Uh, just a second. Uh, so there's. I'm gonna find it just a quick second. Oh, there. We got Samhain. Uh, the Winter Solstice, Yule. And the Feast of the Morgan, and actually we go to Beltane, so there's Ostara missing, and there's Candlemas, so there's two Sabbats missing, and that's the one thing I have that to say against this book, because it's very well written, written. it's um, it's very complete, um, quite honestly, and there's even little chance to the Morgan. Uh, there's the, um, just a quick second. Uh, 
there was the charge for the Morrigan. Yep, charge of the Morrigan. Uh, there was also, and at the beginning of each little um, section, there is a little phrase associated with the goddess or with the paragraph. Uh, let me find the one for love. I love that one. Uh, second, searching, searching. <laughs> I feel like a computer. Searching, no oh, processing. Right, goddess of sovereignty. Serious. Where's the goddess of love? Come on, it was there. I saw it. Didn't dream it. Yes, it would be easier to go on the um, the appendix and go. Oh, but I like to complete it myself. So ah, there it is. So. Uh, it was, she is the raven and she is the dove, the ecstasy of battle and love, from Diana L. Paxton, Ravens of Avalon. I just love it. And uh, you got a small, like, um, path working you can do with the, with the goddess, after that you got the explanations and how to harness the power, um, and after you got a bunch of little rituals, incense, oils, so it's really a good book, it's really complete, uh, it's simple to read, it's easy, uh, it's fun, quite a, and it's quite a book, it's quite a size, so um, if you are someone who has the Morgan, has this matron goddess, or uh, looks forward on looking, on working with uh, this particular goddess, this is the book to have. This is gonna tell you exactly what you need to know, how to do it, and why to do it. Sorry. Happens. Whew. Sorry. So I give this book a total of... Yeah. Um... 9.5%. The 0.5 being the two missing rituals. <laughs> But still a very good book and it's a very good note. So well thank you for watching and um Dark Blessings. Bye bye!